Hey everyone, I wanted to share with you something very cool we're working on. Just got my hands on the release candidate of RealWave Vision, which is a tool, a plugin to CloseBot to go high level that allows your bot to see images and analyze them. So, um, I'm going to create a um, demo of an auto shop um, bot that gets a lead, ask for what happened to the car, description of the damage and coordinates a, uh, an appointment. Um, but we'll make it um, look at an image of the damage and uh, get some assessment um, accordingly. So I have a completely empty um, sub account here. Um, and we'll, we're just going to start from scratch and see how it works. To get vision, you go to the app marketplace and you get the real wave app. It's not public yet. You see it's private, um, so you don't have access. It, it will be published next week, hopefully, as soon as they approve it. But in the meanwhile, you can watch the video and see how it works. So I'm going to create a workflow, start from scratch. And I have a Facebook Messenger um, here connected to a Facebook page that I just use for testing. And it's already connected to the sub account. So all I have to do to listen to it is to create a trigger of customer replied. Save. And this would get all of the information coming from a Messenger. Um, and instead of plugging it to, let's say, CloseBot or um, doing something with the message, um, we're going to um, send it to Vision. So what is Vision? Um, there's a new workflow ac action called uh, Vision So you just select. And Vision will come with um, a set of predefined um, vision analyzer like the car shop damage assessor and the electrician troubleshooter um, or the nutrition meal analyzer but we're going to focus on the car shop uh, one for now yes you can create your own custom image analyzer these are just uh, templates built-in templates so let's select the car shop um, we need to tell it what images we want to look at so inside attachment urls We've got a custom value ready um, with the vision input, so you don't even have to think about it. And that's basically it. Click Save. And then just for debug purposes, let's spit the result right out to the uh, messenger window. Maybe we want to add up to 100 words because it is messenger after all. And just send a reply back to messenger. And the message is the result from the real wave vision action response. Save and save. And this should give us a very basic demo of um, the ability to send an image, analyze it, and send the result back to the user. I prepared a list of uh, images here of you know, different kinds of car damage. Let's start with uh, this one here and send it over. Nothing happens naturally because I didn't publish the workflow. So I'm going to publish it, save and do that again. And here we've got the result. Hey, it looks like your red car has some visible damage at the front. Here's what I found. Type of damage, the front bumper the, and headlights area are dented and cracked. That's correct. With part of the headlight exposed. There are also scraps and deformation of the bodywork. Location, severity, moderate to severe. And we've got repair recommendation. Recommendation repair, replace the front bumper and headlight. Estimated time and cost, one to two days. So. Basically, this um, car assessment agent is programmed to look at pictures of car damage and assess them. Um, let's take another example. Um, yeah, maybe this one. Uh, 
And then it looks like uh, there was a significant accident. It was a white car and a truck. The white car has a position of front end damage. It doesn't really know which car we're referring to. Um, the situation likely requires more than cosmetic fixes and a detailed disinfection will help ensure safety and proper restoration. Um, so it knew that there is not enough detail and it looks like there's enough damage to just suggest that you bring the cow over because it's just um, too um, risky. So um, let's take this and try to uh, integrate it into um, a bot that um, collects the information. Um, so I prepared um, a close bot bot, something really simple, a few objectives. Um, get the event description like what happened you had were in an accident or something like that it just collects the information into the description um, get damage info tell me what happened to the car um, again collects it to the car damage description provides the information the assessment um, nothing here uh, yet and then if you want to it continues to email phone and booking so how do we make these work together that's um, really, really simple. Um, so all we have to do is split the workload between vision and close bot. Close bot handles text and vision handles vision. So we need to branch the re replies according to what they really are. So we're just going to add a branch um, and it's going to be uh, image or text image text, image to vision, text to close bot. And then the branch would be, um, we've got a custom value ready for you, um, vision input. So if vision input is not empty, it means we have an image. Otherwise it's text. So that's image and that's text. So if we have an image, go to vision. If we have a text, go to close bot. Let's go to close bot. So we add a webhook um, URL. I don't really remember. Let's see how quickly we can find it. Close bot documentation, help library, collections, quick start, initial setup, two minutes. Let's do it in two seconds. Okay, let's copy and paste the URL and move it here click save and that's it we've got a workflow that routes image to vision and text to close bot and this should actually trigger this bot it's already integrated with my real way vision um, uh, snapshot not snapshot sorry a sub account so as soon as i start typing something like hi it should go to the text route and trigger close bot. Um, let's go to the dashboard here. We should see this hi coming in. Hi, what's up with your car? What happened? So great. Um, it started to the workflow and it's basically now um, trying to collect the, um, the event description. So if we just let it do that, it will be stuck on text. And um, we want at some point when we send the image of the car, we want the description of the damage to go to close bot. So we're gonna use a very um, simple but effective um, method. Instead of sending the result back to the user we're going to delete this guy here we're going to send it to close bot so again we're going to use the webhook let's see if we've got the URL here and here I'm going to add different message and the message is going to be the result of real wave vision response So let's figure out again what we've done. That's everything, by the way. Um, we get the message from the user. If it's a text, as long as they're texting, um, closebot handles everything. 
But when the user sends an image, Vision analyzes it and pushes the um, analysis, the result of the image analysis to Closebot as if the user described the damage to their car. So basically all we're doing is if someone send an image, we look at the image and describe the image for Closebot and this action of describing the image to Closebot is the equivalent of someone looking at the image, assessing it. This is your virtual assistant or assistant looking at the image and providing data to the CRM. So now we're able to automate that. So all we've done is um, add one step um, to the workflow to look at the image and provide the details. Let's see how it all works. I hope it works. So, um, what's up with your car? What happened? Um, I was in a small accident. Oh no, what kind of damage are we talking about? So, now it's uh, the um, money time. If I'm going to type text and I'm going to describe the damage, it's going to go through text going to go to Closebot and Closebot is going to try to fulfill the get damage info. But instead, I'm going to try to send um, an image. Let's take the broken windshield one and just drag it here. So now the image is going to go through this route Vision is going to look at the image, describe the damage, provide all the information about the assessment of the fix and send it to Closebot like the user, like it was a really, really expert user, um, described it um, for us. So this is the Closebot reply. Bummer about the accident. If the windshield is cracked, we should definitely replace it to keep things safe. It usually takes a couple of hours. Want to swing by and get it fixed? We can check out the airbag and give uh, the car a good cleanup too, would it? <laughs> what day works for you? Guys, you've got to um, admit that's really amazing. Um, so yeah, um, let's do it. I'm so excited, I, I mistyped. Let's do it. Um, so now if we go to the dashboard, we can see that um, Closeout basically collected the information about the invent description. Um, we can see it got all of the details um, from Vision about the problem with the car. Um, so now it's asking me for my number. Um, that's because um, the next objectives are um, the phone and the number and the booking. We're not going to go into that. Um, but there you go. You've got an auto shop. Um, bot that can look at the images. We've got tons of um, agents, uh, vision agents ready to go. And I said, you can create your own um, agent looking at anything basically. Um, so yeah, more to come. In the meanwhile, um, um, have a great weekend and uh, see you all soon.